everybody and welcome to Food Blog's first ever series, Marvin's Five, with me, Marvin Gauci. In every episode, I will be limited by five fresh ingredients and I will create one exciting dish to prepare for your family and friends. Today, I will be showing you how to prepare this beautiful pasta dish with pesto, pistachio and prawns. And I'm gonna order my ingredients from my Walt app. Now that my ingredients have arrived, I'm going to unpack our prawns over here. Coriander, pistachios, pasta, lime. And for this dish, we're going to pair it with a beautiful Sauvignon Blanc. So we're gonna kick it off by putting some salt in our boiling water, okay? Put in 200 grams of pasta. and cover it up over there. This will take roughly 10 minutes. On the other hand, we're going to start preparing our pesto. I'm gonna use coriander. Some people find it a little bit of a soapy taste. So whoever wants to uh, use uh, basil instead, feel free to use that, okay? I'm gonna cut a lime, put in a lime of juice in our Coriander. I have 10 cloves of garlic, 50 milliliters of olive oil, and 50 grams of pistachios. Okay? Now, I'm going to blend it in. Make sure it's nice and crushed. Beautiful. So, we're going to get our pan. We'll clean up a little bit while we're working. We'll turn this one on, on medium heat to get a little bit of heat in our pan. We're going to put in some olive oil, just a little bit of olive oil. Once it heats up and it starts pushing, we're going to throw in our prawns, over here I can start peeling the prawns, remove the head, it's quite easy. Just take the skin out of the prawns, there you go, and press the tail to get the whole meat over there, as you see, okay? There you go. These are already deveined, I don't need to devein them, if you, there you go, there's a little bit of vein over there. So if, you, if they're not deveined, just open, open here with a, a knife and then devein it from over here, okay? Nice. Now that our pan is almost ready for us to start, we're going to throw in the prawns. There you go. I'm gonna chop the prawns a little bit. I want them this bite-sized, so when you're eating with the pasta, it goes onto the fork pretty easy. And there you go. Amazing, there you go. Super. This is nice and Hot. Over here I have the coriander, the lime, the pistachios and the rest of our recipe that was garlic. We haven't put already salt and pepper and we're going to put it in our pan while we're cooking. Amazing. There you go. That's nicely sealed on the top. I'm going to put in the mixture that we blitzed earlier.
into our pan and I'm going to mix it and get that little bit of taste that comes out of the pan from the bottom. If you notice the, the brown parts that are down at the bottom of the pan will give us a beautiful texture in our taste. I'm gonna add some salt, some chili pepper to your liking, and some pepper. Be generous on the seasoning, and this is almost ready. Now we wait for the pasta to cook a little bit more, and we toss it all together. There you go. Now, if you find yourself that uh, your, your mixture, your recipe is a little bit dry, like this, we take some pasta water, we add it to our pan to give it that lovely texture and consistency. Perfect. I'm going to remove my pasta from the water and strain it. Brilliant. Mix it all in together. Beautiful. The smell out of the coriander and the rest of the ingredients are really, really good. Ready. Now we just plate. Now that our pasta is ready, we're gonna plate. Beautiful aroma coming out of our pan. Thanks to the coriander and the rest of the ingredients. There you go. Beautiful. This is the consistency you want the sauce and the pesto. That it looks all sticky with the rest of the pasta. Now we're going to garnish it a little bit with some coriander. I'm gonna taste it. Mm, perfect combination. Thank you guys for joining me to this uh, recipe and uh, from here I'd like to thank you for joining us and also I would like to thank uh, Walt and also Fino for providing us with the ingredients and our kitchen. Don't forget to press the like button. That's it for... Shkina! <laughs> 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 <laughs>